Hello, can you step out of the vehicle for me? Yeah, because you just slammed into a car and took off. You just crashed into a vehicle and took off. I cannot open this door, so I can't say anything back. She don't have pants on. I'm okay. trying to. I just disclosed my pants. I'm trying to change into something different. Okay. Okay. Is that okay? I, yeah. Or am I not allowed to change? I'm letting the mail. I'm letting the mail officer know. Please put your pants on. Please Could put you your pants on. Could you please put your pants on? I'm trying to. But he you, cannot see you. He is backed away from you the back window. Away from my car, please. Why I'm trying to put my pants on. Put your pants on. She's. I'm literally. I'm trying to just. Okay. Stop talking. Clothes. Okay. Stop Why talking and put talk? the pants on. Put the pants have, on. I'm trying to put my pants on, but you're not giving me the right to talk. I'm telling you to stop what you're stop talking, put the pants on and then we'll talk. Stop what I'm doing. I'm doing put what the I pants mean. on. I'm trying to put my pants on. I'm trying not to be difficult. Come on, man. I'm really not trying to. I'm just trying to put my pants on. I don't feel comfortable with this male over here. He's back behind the car. He is okay, not near you. You're being like very hostile, so please. You guys are giving me anxiety because you're rushing me. Okay, her pants are on. You're good. Okay. Can she not step out? Is... Go ahead and exit the vehicle, and I'll grab these shoes for you. Yes. No. no. Yep. Okay. Stop. Take a deep breath. Stop. Take a deep breath. I'm going to have you step out of the vehicle with that officer, and I will get shoes for you. I can't step out of this car. Why? I'm inside. I just told you it's not. I can't function with it. Can you fall over the seat and go to the other officer? Okay. Go ahead. Okay. No one's I'm making anything stressful. Go ahead and come out this way. I am accommodated by the uh, um, Association of American Disabilities Act. Okay. So please do not pressure me. No one's pressuring you. I'm asking you. You said you can't I get out of the car. I said that you were pressuring okay. me. So it doesn't Stop. matter what you're... Stop. I don't care what you say. Stop. Please just let me do what I'm supposed to do, okay? Without without saying anything, okay? Exit Thank the you. vehicle. Trying to. I said, but please do not pressure me to do something I don't want to do. I'm trying, okay? I'm trying. I have my hands up. Just exit the vehicle. Okay, I'm trying. You just put me off edge, honestly. Okay, let's go. Go where? Get out of the vehicle. I'm trying. I want you to get out of the car. I'm trying to get out You're of the not. car. You're not. Get out of the car. I am... Get up and get out of the car. What happened today? I don't have to disclose any information to you. Obviously, a crime took place because you hit a vehicle and you I took off. I did not hit anything. Oh, so your vehicle is telling me... Oh, yeah, because that was happened. That was... Um, Way before. So you're telling me all the glass so that's laying on North Grove is not yours. You have no idea where that came from. Nope. It's not from your vehicle. No, you can go ahead and uh, put evidence in it if you want to. Go ahead and put that glass and match it up to mine. Not mine. Okay. Because so this happened on uh, 97. I hit a deer. And that's what happened. In 1997, you're telling me. No, not in 1997. I'm what are you, what are you, words in my mouth. What are you I'm saying? I'm saying on road hey. 97. Slow down. You're not going to raise your voice. He's trying to have a conversation. I'm asking okay, you but what now happened. he's putting words in my he's mouth. Not. No, I'm not. He's not. He's asking to clarifying questions. I'm trying to understand. Well, she already set me off edge. I'm not trying. Like okay. I said to begin with, I'm not trying to be like an asshole. Okay, listen, listen. I've already been told that I'm the most complicated person to deal with. Okay. So please don't tell me something well, I already this. don't know. Okay, let's start okay, with this. Let's please. start with this. What's okay. your name? What's your name, ma'am? No. I don't have to disclose that information. You do, because there's been a there's a crime that took place. Okay, so you do. Go ahead and run the license plate, and you can find the information. Yeah. How much have you had to drink today? Nothing. Nothing. Just talk to your friend and said you guys came from a bar Who? from Toledo. Who? I don't have friends. Okay, you just dropped her off, and that's when you backed I into the other vehicle. Listen, 
you told me that you don't that want. You could you? Gave could you listen? Because you're could you listen? Could you listen? Could you listen? Because there was a male that I was naked in front of. Number one, you weren't naked. Number two, yes, I was. You I weren't. had no pants on. You had underwear on. All of your private parts were covered. Oh, so go God. ahead and pause. This is a thong. So go ahead and so pause yourself. My private parts, go ahead, but not my thigh. Go ahead and stop right now. You Come told on. you stated that you didn't want to be difficult and you didn't want to be cooperative. And then then exactly cooperate. Like, okay, but I'm trying to cooperate, but he's asking me stupid ass questions. Look up the fucking license plate. Asking your name is not a stupid question. He's it trying is. to look up the license plate. I did look up the license plate, okay, but I would like to confirm name. it. Get the name, then you'll know it. I'm going to read you your rights to. before I ask you more Go questions. Ahead, I already know my rights. Okay, you have the rights to remain silent on anything you say. Kenneth will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have him or her present with you while you're being questioned. If you cannot have afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent I you before any question if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights, not answer any questions, make any statements. Do you understand each of these rights I've explained to you? Obviously, I do. Okay. You said that. Okay, with these rights in mind, are you going to answer any questions for us or no? no? I will not, and I'll let you arrest me because that's what I'm going to do because I'm going to let it go through court. Just like I'll let my the rest of my life do. Okay. Well, then. Go ahead. I'm trying to figure out what's going on, ma'am. Go ahead. You were the one who stated that you wanted to be cooperative and you wanted to work through it. I did. It. Okay. So, so I, he's I'm giving not... you he's giving you the opportunity right now. He's not telling you you're under arrest. He's not yelling. He's not arguing. He's just asking Honestly, you questions. I want to be in jail right now. Why do you want to be in jail right because now? Because I don't want to be around my mom and my and their kids and everything. <laughs> Please okay. take me away. That's that's not how this works. You don't just get to decide. What we can do is we can Please offer. Please take me with. I ran away in the first place and I hit a f deer on 97. Okay. So on road okay. 97. Okay. It's called County Road 97, Hancock County, if you're not familiar. Thank I'm not you. familiar with Hancock County. Okay, thank, thank you. for clarifying that. I'm not that. talking to you, I'm talking to her. It's Hancock okay. County, um. Okay, you said you ran away. Ran away? You just said when you ran away. You said that's no, why you ran away. I said I left. Okay. Okay. That's when I left. Okay. I'm Listen. And I hit a f***ing deer. Okay. Did you hit it with the front of your car? Yeah, it's not even in your guys' county. Okay. Like so if you hit the... And I, I don't have, I like to test I don't have an market. insurance claim to put on it, so it. why do you care? I'm not asking about the deer. I'm just... I'm asking okay. clarifying questions regarding the Okay, car. this is the damage so, from the deer. So if you hit a deer with the front of your car, why is there damage to the back of because your vehicle? Because it hit the f***ing front of the car. Like just now? No. I did right. not say that. I right. said so, it hit on 97 in the middle of the f***ing night. So and, and we have multiple calls of a vehicle leaving the scene of an accident matching this exact description of your vehicle. Okay. Is there a license plate number? Is there any they surveillance? They gave the license plate number. Yes, it is this license plate. Okay. Is there any surveillance? Is there any we video multiple, claim? We have multiple callers. Okay. So. You have an All open right. container in there as well. Of Mike's hard. That was supposedly my friend. Listen to me. We're trying to figure out what's going on. You're giving us nothing. Exactly, because I'm not going to. You, you guys have nothing. We have plenty. I'm giving okay, you your you opportunity to explain to us what happened. Why? Why do you care about me? Why would I not? Why would I not? You just get what Why you do realize. you care about me? Why do you care about what outcome is mine? Why? Here. Because I don't want to just take you to jail. Why not? Why? Because I would like to know because what's going on. I would like your side of the story. Why do you care? Well, he wants to help you. Oh, it's not yes. just about going to jail. If you're having issues outside then of... I need to leave the state, and I've been trying to leave. And I can't. Have you had anything to drink today? No, I did not. Do you take prescription medication for Yes, anything? I do. What do you take? I'm no. not going to disclose that information. Okay. When's the last time you took your prescription medication? I'm not going to disclose that information. Do you have any thoughts of self-harm? Nope. Do you want to, you want to ha harm anybody else? Never. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You're not going to tell us anything. What else am I supposed to do? Give us your side of the story, which I'm giving you the opportunity to do. Why would I do that? Why would you do that? So I can understand from your you point of view what happened. Me. If I didn't care about you, I wouldn't give you this opportunity. I'd throw you in handcuffs and throw you in the back okay. of my car, and we'd figure everything Please, else out after that. You. But I'm giving you the opportunity to tell me what happened. But why? Why? Because I want to hear your you side of the story. You know my first name. You are not giving me your first name. You did know it, though. 
going to jail isn't going to get you any help. If you're looking for help, if you need help, need help. Okay, listen, hear me out. Going to jail doesn't do anything but put you in a cell. It locks you up. We're what we're, what we're looking to do is help you to the best of our abilities. Okay, so if you are struggling, if you are having any mental I'm health issues, if you do issues, need to speak with somebody. I don't. Thank you for your concern. And that's so, the thing. We're trying to work with you. you. No, I don't. Are you willing to do field sobriety tests, ma'am? No, I do not. I'm not consenting to anything. The reason why I ask is your friend that was in the vehicle said you guys came from... you're talking to. Like, I have a lot of friends over here. You know, the, um, actually, not 419, 0149 is Doc's, um, big... Are you injured? I'm asking if you're injured. You were involved in a car accident, so I'm asking I if you're injured. I was not in a car accident. Okay. Yes, you were. Okay. That's your opinion. You're supposed to just cooperate with us. We're not here to hurt you. You guys are going to take me away anyway. That's not true. That's not this. What we're doing right now, he's giving you... Every opportunity possible to not... I know, and I'm ruining it, because I don't give a f Okay, but we do care. What we're doing is, we're working with you so that you don't have to go to jail. Okay? Because we don't want to... We don't care about that. We're going to do paperwork either way. We don't care about paperwork. We're basically just secretaries. We do paperwork every day. It's, it has nothing to do with that. What we're doing is we're trying to serve the community to the best of our abilities. Yeah. We're trying... Okay, so we're trying to talk to you. So am I. I'm trying to give back to my mom. Okay. Well, listen. <laughs> but all she does is fucking take pills and take my dad's money. Okay. Because he died. Okay. Okay, so listen. I see. <laughs> and then she's going to fucking. $50 a month. Okay. Oh, you owe me $50 a month. I'm literally in between jobs and I got fucked over my accommodation. Okay. Okay, listen. And I get that that would be upsetting. And what we want to do is help you. We don't want to take you to jail. Care. I know, I but but care. you're saying you're between jobs. You're saying you're struggling with money. Going to jail is not going to help you at all. I don't care, though. Okay, what but we do care. Jail. You're supposed to listen. Listen, deep breath. You're supposed to cooperate with us so that we can help you. We are here to help you, and we're here to keep the community safe. Okay. Since when? Have, have you? Okay. These officers wanted to help. Okay. The well, starting. Public. Okay. Starting right when? now. We've ne you've never dealt with me before. Have you met either of these officers before? So you can't generalize about all three of us. Okay? We're here to help. You might have had bad experiences with police officers in the past. We can correct that right now. You can have a good experience with us. That's your choice to do that. Okay? We don't want to take you to jail. We want to get you the help that you need, whatever that be. But you've got to start with working with us. Okay? Work with us and give us your name. Okay? Work with us. We'll work with you slowly, okay? We'll figure out what's going on. Okay, that's fine. If you don't need medical attention, that's fine. Okay. 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 One step at a time. And that's what I mean. If you're having money trouble, going to jail is not the best idea. Because then you're going to have to... because I don't have a responsibility. But then you'll have more fines and more court costs, and the responsibility will be waiting when you get out. So let's take a deep breath. Okay. Do you have your driver's license on you? You feel like what? Okay. Well, we're. I don't know if I should believe you. What? Why would you not believe me? I recognize that you said you've had bad experiences with police officers in the past, but just the way you wouldn't want me to stereotype you or judge you, I I'm asking you. Anything to do with it? With what? Anything. Like I just don't want anything. Okay. Well, unfortunately, you are involved. Okay. So you might as well make the best of it. Okay, so work with us, we'll work with you. I'm going to ask you again, and we can forget about everything that happened previously regarding what you said, if you're willing to be honest. Okay, you stated that you hit a deer on 97 at the, with the front of your vehicle, okay? Okay. Okay. Because I have anxiety. Okay, you backed up. There was cars coming at me. Okay. And there was two cars coming at me, and I tried to back up really slow, and I accidentally pushed the backside of the car. 
accelerator instead of pushing the brake. Okay. And and that's when the damage in the back occurred? Okay. I'm I'm working with you, I'm listening. Okay. So you you meant to back up slowly, you accidentally hit the accelerator, you backed up too fast, and that's how the damage in the back occurred? When I hit the deer. Okay. There's no need to lie to me. I'm being cooperative with you, and you're being cooperative with me, and we're working through this. Give me just a second. Got her name. She basically gets to the point where she said she was going to pick up her boyfriend. She said she just got her license back, just got a car, and she ruined it all in one day. At one point, she said she was backing up. She got really bad anxiety. She thought she slowed down. She hit the accelerator, and she backed up, basically backed up and hit something. Then she, when I tried to ask her clarifying questions, she got pissed, stopped talking, and then she went back to the I hit a deer story. Um, she said that she has constant thoughts of self-harm. Um, she wants to hurt herself. She seemed impaired to you. I feel like I can smell the odor. I can't tell though, like, is it just because she is on medication? Is it just because she's mixed? You have, you have the odor mixed. I'm, what I'm trying to gather is I want to do a search warrant. So I'm trying to figure out why the to do a search warrant to try to okay it because we have no one no pain to after just pulling the which is not mm -hmm. So I did I, see that her other pants were on the floor. So it looked like she took her pants off, they were on the floor, and she was pulling another set of pants up. I know that doesn't help, but... No, I, if you have the odor on top of it, I think... You know, I'm gonna, we're going to put her in Let me see if I can get her to do the test with you. Okay. She's being a little bit cooperative right now, and I might be able to get her to do it. Okay. Based on the head schedule, I'll tell her this, but she's going to It looks like there's either a container of marijuana or some type of... So, she's probably not going to do an eval with me, but we can try. So, if you want to see, see what I can do. Alright, so here's where we're at. He's a lot better trained than I am, okay, when it comes to certain things. Okay, is there any chance that you'll go through the... Um, testing process just to make sure you're not impaired. We just want to rule it out. Okay. So basically you're my saying feet, my feet are not from standing here, okay? Okay. All right. But so here's what I'm saying. You're telling me you're not impaired at all, right? No, but like I okay. already have like my arthritis in my leg. Okay. So, like, and I'm we already can... like limping on this leg. Okay, and we can take we can take that into account, okay? We can take that into account it's and we can note that. Okay. Because and I'm so inflamed right now. Okay, and we can take that into account. But here's what I'm saying. If if you're not impaired, which you're telling me you're not, we want to rule that out. So if I you're never saying said no we're not. You we asked if you had been drinking, if you were impaired, if you had taken anything and you said you weren't. Okay. Okay, so if you're not, can we do these tests with you just so we can rule that out? Just so that we can say, okay. She's not impaired. We'll cross that off her list. She's being cooperative with us. Okay. Are you willing to do that? I mean, it makes better on your guys' record. It, it'll help you, too, so that we can go through it. Like I said. I don't care about me. I'm looking for you. Okay. Well, it, it, if you're willing to do it, it would. It would be good if you will for do you. it. For, for everyone involved. I'll have you step right up here. Let's go through. Let's start with just the eye test. We'll go with that, and then we'll take it one step at a time. You want to wipe your eyes? I tried wiping them multiple times. Okay. Okay. Here's what I'm going to do is uh, you put your feet together, hands on your sides for me. Just stay in that position for me. I have a few questions for you, okay? Cover glasses or contacts. Should. You should. Okay. Do you have any issues with your eyes other than blurred vision? He just means you have cataracts. Like, do you have so cataracts? You have... Have, you, have you injured your eye where you, like, ran into a tree branch or something, anything like that? Okay, have you recently been in a car accident? He has to ask These that. These are the it just questions. Goes with before, the I go, before I do the test, I have to ask you some numerous questions that go into it. Have you recently been in a car accident? I recently hit a deer. Okay. 
Have you had any head trauma? Any concussions? No? Or you, not, that you're, not that you're aware of? Okay. When I have you do is follow tip my pen with your eyes, your eyes only do not move your head. You understand that? Okay. Sun is right in my eye. Oh, uh, let's turn you then. Yep. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, bring Taylor hands out your sides again. Perfect. Absolutely. You see it okay? Kinda. It's just like shifting. It's gonna move. It's gonna move a little bit. But can you can you see it? It's okay if it's blurry. But can you see it okay? and follow straight up, okay? I can't move my head. Nope. I have a sty, actually. That is, it looks like a gnat. It's, okay. It is a sty. I do have a sty. Do I have? You're good. Oh, okay. Let's care. head over here, okay? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I'll give you some set of instructions when we get over here, okay? I'll maybe go to the end of the line for me. If you could, uh, put your left foot on the line, okay? Right foot in front of your left foot, touching heel oh, to toe. actually, can I say something? I'm sure. so sorry. I had a pigeon toed. Okay. So I always walk, like, you can see, like, I'm walking, and it yeah. goes inward. I'm yep. inward already, so I can't go completely straight, but I will walk straight away. Okay. So put your left foot on the line, right foot in front of your left foot, touching heel to toe, hands on your sides for me, okay? Hold on. Get it right. Put your right foot in front of your left foot, touching heel to toe. Yeah, left foot on the line. Oh, right foot, foot yeah, line left foot right in front of your right foot in front of your left foot, touching heel okay, to toe. Wait, okay. Sorry, let me explain it one more time. Put your left foot on the line. Put put your right foot in front of your left foot, okay. touching heel to toe. Okay. Okay. Is that how we're gonna start? Yep. I'm gonna These give you some more. <laughs> Keep your hands down on your sides. Okay. Okay. Do not start until I tell you to. Okay. Just stay in this position. How from many times do I have to count? I'll explain everything to you. Okay, and I'll give you a demonstration. So from here, you're gonna take yeah, nine. No, I, that's part of it is I have to have you in that position, okay? okay. So left foot on line, right foot in front of your left foot, touching heel to toe. Hands on your sides for me, okay? Straight Okay. From here, you're going to take nine heel toe steps down along this line, okay? When you get to your ninth step, I want you to leave your lead foot on the line. You're going to do a serious foot. lead foot, so yep. My lead foot is my right. Your lead foot is going to be whichever foot is forward when you, when you get to your ninth step. Okay. okay? You're going to leave that foot on the line. Can I stop and, like... Because I just like I'll, I'll, let me, let me get through all the instructions. I'm sorry, I'm okay. So because, up. because some of the instructions will answer your questions. Like, That's not why. like, up, but like, I'm the head. Like, I'm so <laughs> up. Okay. So, nine heel toe steps down along the line. When you get to your ninth step, leave your lead foot on the line. Do a series of small steps to turn around. You're going to do nine heel toe steps back down along the line, okay? Can you, um, demonstrate I will that? in just, I will in just a minute. Okay, while you're doing this, I need you to look down at your feet. I need you to count your steps out loud. Keep your hands down at your sides. Okay, once you start the test, do not stop the test till you complete the test. Do you understand those instructions so far? Okay, so do not move yet. I'll give you a demonstration, okay? We're gonna pretend, we're gonna pretend there's a line right in front of me, okay? So left foot on the line, right foot in front of your left foot, touching heel, toe, hands on your side. This is where you're gonna start. You're gonna go one, two, don't start yet. Three, I took three steps, you'll continue to nine steps, okay? You're gonna leave that lead foot on the line, series of small steps to turn around, okay? You're gonna do, Cannot. You do nine heel toe steps back down the long line. So, so I, like, move my. Let me, ma'am. Let me let me finish the instructions, okay? I know. Sure I'll answer your it. questions as soon as I'm done, okay? Just stay in that position for me. So then nine heel toe steps back down along the long line. So one, two, three. Once again, I took three steps. You'll continue to nine steps, okay? Do you want me? You want me to do nine? You want all nine? Yeah. I'll demonstrate all nine to you. I want to see if you can do it, man. <laughs> Go ahead. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Leave that lead foot on the line. Series of small steps. Turn around. Okay. Do you understand? Yes. That's, okay. I'm just making sure that I understand okay. correctly. I didn't okay. Like, oh, you're fine. Five. So so here's the deal. I need you to, once again, just uh, just reiterate, nine heel toe steps back down. Leave your lead foot on the line, 
nine, do a series of small steps like I showed you, nine heel-toe suspect down the line, long line, okay? While you're doing nine this, forward, nine. nine forward, do the turn down like down. I sh like I showed you, down. yep. Count your steps out loud, look down at your feet, keep your hands down at your sides, once you start the test, do not stop the test until you finish, do you understand? Yes, I do. Any other questions? No, I do not. Okay, you may begin. That's your starting position. So your first step will be number one. Oh, Look down and count out loud, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Absolutely. Good, you can begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Nine, forward, 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 Last time, okay? Alright, that's the last time. Okay. Go and begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, nine. Okay, turn around face me. Now what I want you to do is uh, get in the, put your feet together, hands on your sides. Stay in position until I tell you to begin. Do not begin until I tell you to. Do you understand that? Okay, so from here you're going to pick up a foot of your choosing. I don't care which foot you pick up, okay? okay. You're going to raise that foot out in front of you, so approximately six inches off the ground. Don't do it yet. Okay, I want that foot, <laughs> I want that foot parallel to the ground. Is your name Ryan? It is not. You look like Ryan. Ryan, okay? I want, it, I want it parallel to the ground. I want you to keep both your feet straight at all times. Can I look at it or not? You are going to look at it. You're going to look down at that raised foot. I didn't get there yet. I'm sorry. almost there. I'm so okay. sorry. I should not at be an asshole. Right. <laughs> so, so we'll, I'll start over and explain it to you. So you're going to pick up a foot of whatever foot you decide to pick up, okay? Approximately six inches off the ground. You're going to hold it out in front of you. You're going to look down at that raised foot, okay? You're going to have it parallel to the ground, both your feet straight. You're going to count out loud in the following manner, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003. You're going to keep counting until I tell you to stop counting, Okay. okay. Why you do this? I need your hands to remain at your sides. Okay. Do you understand all that? Yeah, I was kind of stiff on the foot. Okay, I'll give you a demonstration. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick up my right foot. Okay. Okay. okay so you're gonna pick it up. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005. You're gonna keep counting until I tell you to stop counting. Okay. Do you understand? Do you have any questions? I do not. I do have a very bad balance. <laughs> okay. Even... Which foot do you think you're gonna raise? Do it when I want to. Okay. Oh, I'm going to raise my right foot because my right foot is the bad one, so I'm going to put all my pressure on my left. Okay. You may begin whenever you're ready. Can you put that foot parallel to the ground, please? Like, point your toes downward. Oh. You know what I mean? 1,001, 1, Put it down a little more. It's only six inches. Okay, you can stop. Yeah. My... So hard. Okay, one more thing, okay? You're going to turn around and face that way for me. Turn around and face that way for me. You're under arrest today for driving with a vehicle while impaired, okay? Put your hands together like your brain. Put your palms together. Do you have anything on you that can harm me, stick me, cause me any bodily harm, anything like that? Okay. So... We're gonna head back here. We're gonna head back here to my car, okay? I'm gonna have I'm gonna have Officer West patch you down, make sure you don't have anything on you. And then from there, we're gonna go to the police station. I'm gonna read through some paperwork with you, okay?
and then I'll and then I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, I'll read some paperwork to you and I'll offer you a breath test. Okay, go ahead and take a seat. Okay, ma'am. Can you take a seat for me? Yeah, I'm just. I know. I know. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna unless I have to. Okay. I know you've you've been through a lot. It seems like today, so I don't want to, you know, make it worse if I don't have to. Okay. Let me ask you this. Do you, is there anything in the vehicle that you need? Like a cell phone, your wallet, anything like that? Well, we're going to grab your phone. Where's your phone located? Okay. Well, I'm going to have Officer West grab me your, your phone, so we're going to take that with us, okay? Do you have a wallet? Anything else you want out of there? I have my car keys. Okay. We'll take that care of that here in a minute, okay? Just hang tight for me. go back to Rohan. I'm supposed to go back to where? I'm sorry. I'm supposed to go back to my roommate. Where's your roommate live? I'm oh, sorry. I don't even have a car. Okay. That's why I picked him up. Okay. Um, so I didn't want to go through this. I'm just trying to go home. Okay, ma'am. Well, we got one more step, okay? And after that, we'll, we'll see about what we can do to get you to get you home, okay? So what we need to do, okay? Sound good? What did I do wrong? As far as what? As far as like, what did I do wrong? Is my feet too sweaty? Or no, no, no. It's what? They so are. listen, listen. Everything I put you through gives me indicators of impairment. Okay, they're not like pass fail tests. It just gives me indicators that you're impaired. I think you're impaired today. Okay. Is my medicine? Or I'm crying. No, it could it could be medication. Could be alcohol. Could okay, be a combination. So that's my doctor's fault. Okay. Okay. Not mine. Okay, well, I, I smell the odor of alcohol. You have an open container in the vehicle, okay? And I got multiple indicators that you're impaired, okay? So, like I said... What did I do wrong in the sobriety test? Like I told you, there's, it's not right or wrong. It's it's indicators, okay? It gives me it gives me signs, know, like, clues. It gives me clues. Think about it. Key what? Key indicators. Yeah, it's just... Yeah. Yeah, so I'm just looking for give indicators. Me the, what, you're, what did I do wrong? Can You're, I correct I, myself anyway? I, you, you cannot at this point, okay? I know, but like, what can I do right? Here's, what here's, did I do wrong? How can you, how can you say that I'm impaired when I did everything right and I followed your instructions? You did not exactly follow my instructions to a T. I have dyslexia. Okay. And I get things mixed up. Ma'am, here's the deal, okay? So we're going to go to the police station. I'm going to read some paperwork to you, okay? As long as you're cooperative with me there, I'll take you out of handcuffs for this portion of it, okay? You've been, after the first part... Did you not hear me saying cat? Okay, listen. You were, besides the beginning, we're going to we're gonna scratch that beginning when you were, you were upset when I first approached the vehicle, okay? We're going we're gonna to forget about that part, okay? Besides that, you've been pretty cooperative. Okay, so we're going to go to the police station. I'll read through some paperwork with you. I'm going to offer you a breath test, okay? And then we're going to go from there. Sound, yeah, sound, fuck it. sound fair? Yeah. Okay. Okay, hang tight for me, okay? You doing okay back there, ma'am? Yeah, my hands hurt. Okay, well, here's what we're going to do. Like I said, literally the police station is that big, I giant, know, tall building. I know where it's at. Yeah, so we're going to go straight over there, mm -hmm. and I'll, as long as you continue being cooperative, you are going to come out of those handcuffs, okay? Thank you. You are absolutely welcome. Like I said, my goal is not to make this whole experience any worse than it has to be, okay? No, but I had so bad experience with one. Well, here's, here's the deal. I'm not them. Officer West isn't them, okay? I appreciate you. And... And we're going to be as, like, I, I was respectful to you when I walked up to the car and realized you didn't have pants on. I know, and I was okay. literally in the middle of changing my clothes because I had them on for two days. Okay. And that's, and that's, I was respectful towards you, and I backed away, so that way you could finish getting, getting dressed. So, I mean, I wasn't... I only really have the bag of my clothes in the back of my car. Okay. I don't know what else to, I just want to leave. Okay. 47 of course. You're out to for a test. I'm gonna get out of this environment. Okay. Okay, let's get you. Let's get. Go ahead and step out. Go ahead and step out so we can get. Do you need help out? Okay, I got you. I got you. My skin is anemic. Okay. I 
bruise very easily. It okay. hurts. Okay, we're going to go upstairs and we'll get those off, okay? This is the weight of my whole, my whole body, the weight of... Okay, well, once we get up there, you can we sit down. Front, okay. I can't. We're gonna. We're literally gonna be right up, right upstairs. Okay. Once we get up there, I'll take them right off of you. Cause you've been cooperative. Can you hold this for me, please, West. Thank you. I'll go grab the paperwork. I'll meet you up there. Awesome. Thank you. Yep. Go ahead and face this wall for me, okay? Right here. Right here. Okay. I'm gonna take them off of you. What I need you to do after I take these off of you? Absolutely. Do me a favor. See that, see that blue chair right there in front of you? Just go ahead and take a seat right there, okay? Two. Looks like you have, is it two priors? Yes, I do. Okay. So, if you... I'm sorry to hear that. One, four, three. So here's the deal. If you refuse to take a chemical test today, um, with two priors, you would have a three-year license suspension. I'm not going to. I'm not. I'm so I'll do it. I'm not, not going to do it. I understand what you're saying. So yeah. I'll ask you, I'll officially here in a minute, I'll ask you if you want to take it because the machine has to go to that. Yep. Okay, so here's here's what's gonna happen. Do you wanna do you wanna submit to a breath test today? Yes, I do. Okay, so the way this machine works is it's gonna have you provide two samples. Okay, you're gonna blow in the machine two times. It's gonna take the lesser of your two samples, and that's what it's gonna count towards your test. Does that make sense? Okay. okay. Take a really deep breath, and then just blow out a steady stream, wrap your lips around it, and blow out a steady stream. Okay. You want to hear a steady beep, okay? So go ahead and take another big deep breath without your mouth, okay? And then wrap your lips around it and blow. Hard. Yes. Mm. Oh, huh? No, go. Just blow. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Good. Okay, we're going to do it one more time. So if your iron point is here, the equal level is lower. So that makes a big difference now. You're not like, now. You said you were. Oh, yeah. So, like, when you're under 21, you're 20, it's only a point two. Same thing, take a big deep breath and blow out as hard as you can, okay? Keep going, 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 keep going. Keep going. Good. Okay, you ready for this? Okay, so legal limit in Ohio is 0.080. Okay. You're 144. Okay. Okay, so you're almost twice the legal limit. Okay. So with that, you're gonna today you're gonna be as now you're placed under a license suspension. Yep. So let me read this to you. We're gonna read this bottom paragraph. Okay. Okay. Independent of any penalties or sanctions imposed upon you pursuant to any other section of the revised code or municipal ordinance, your driver's license or commercial driver's license, permit or non-resident operating privilege is now suspended. The suspension takes place immediately. The suspension will last at least until your initial appearance on the charge, which will be held within five days after the date of the arrest or the issuance of the citation to you. Can I drive? No. Oh, yeah. You may, you may appeal the suspension at your initial appearance before the court that hears the charges against you that resulted from the arrest or during the period of time ending 30 days after the initial appearance. So, since you provided a sample with two priors, it's a two-year license suspension from this point forward, okay? Okay, so here's what's going to happen, okay? We're going to...
We're going to go out into the hallway. I'm going to have you take a seat in one of the seats. There's a drinking fountain out there. She said you were thirsty. And there's a bathroom out there if you have to use the bathroom. I don't have anything to do. Okay. Hey, but you're not free to go yet because I have other paperwork to do, okay? I'm going to in my pocket. Fine. So she's going to give you your wallet, your phone. Um, we'll, go, we'll go out there. And then, um, yeah, we'll go from there. So you can go ahead and follow me. Yeah. Yeah, I got some stuff. Well, can we use your counter if you don't mind? No, no that's fine. Okay. okay. <laughs> that's what she said. She said no. Okay. Yeah, she said, you I know, just go work ahead. here. I don't even work here. <laughs> so I need two signatures from you. That's it. I'll explain it to you. So this one is, I read the back, back of this form to you, and I'm going to provide you a copy, okay? So if you could just give me a signature right there next to driver's signature. Yep. I don't have a driver's license. Not anymore. You don't know. <laughs> So I don't want to put any salt in the wounds. Nope. Are you holding that for just a second? Yes. This will honor just for a second. So we got one more. Okay. That one's yours. This is mine. So this. No, this is a ticket for the open container of alcohol in your, in your motor vehicle, okay? So, your information? Yes, it is. Today's the date. This is the date. This is open container of alcohol in a motor vehicle. You were in City Lot 4 when I saw you. Obviously, I summoned you after you were arrested, okay? So, I see a signature next to the X. Not admitting guilt, just advising you. You're going to go to court on... Everything's going to be on Monday. Great. I'll take that back from you. Monday, Monday. Monday is actually a mindset Monday. Motivation Monday. And I was like, oh, I'm sure. So, so for the traffic stuff, for the OVI in general, that court date is Monday at 1 o'clock. This would technically be 2.30 on Monday. But what they'll do is they'll, yeah, well, they'll, uh, the judge will just probably, most likely, I don't want to put words and talk for him, but they'll put everything together. So when you get there at 1 o'clock, I'll take care of everything, okay? So there's that. Here's your copy of your test results, okay? And then here's the citation. You can frame it. You can do whatever you want with it. Okay, you can, you can do whatever you want with it. Here's your citation. It's kind of long because, unfortunately, because of... So here, I'll explain it all to you. So once again, court date's the 17th at 1 o'clock in the afternoon in Bologna Municipal Court. Address to the court I underlined for you. Phone number the, to the court I circled in case for whatever reason you can't be there, okay? I don't want to put a warrant out for your ass. That's not bad. So, same thing again. Your information, vehicle information, okay? And then, so, you got the improper rules for starting and backing since you backed into the car, okay? Then you got the A1A, the A1D, and then this other page, which that's just the OVI. Bottom one's your test results. And then the last part of this is the hit skip, since you left the scene of the accident.